before administering the fertility injection. Check the expiry date on every box. Check that you have the correct drug and strength. Wash your hands and clean the skin around the injection area. Do not touch any uncovered needle. Preparation First, gather all the material required for the injection. These include the drug vial, the sodium chloride diluent ampule, a protective sleeve, a syringe, two needles, 25 gauge and 27 gauge, and two alcohol swabs. Step 1. Attach needle to the syringe for mixing, 25 gauge thickness and 1 and 1 fourth inches length. Twist to tighten and set aside. Step 2. Hold the ampule base upright. Tap the ampule gently to ensure that all the solution is at the base. Look for the scoring line at the neck of the ampule. Hold the top and base firmly. Step 3. Hold the protective sleeve from the top of the ampule and snap the top off. The ampule should break at the neck only. Step 4. Insert the needle into the ampule and draw out all the solution. Step 5. Now take the vial, remove its cap and wipe the top with an alcohol swab. Step 6. Insert the needle at an angle through the grey rubber circle. Point the needle tip to the wall of the vial and gently empty the solution into it. Step 7. Remove the needle and rotate the vial by swirling it between your thumb and index finger. Step 8. Continue to swirl until the solution appears clear. Step 9. Pull back the plunger to the dosage mark before inserting the needle into the rubber circle. Step 10. Gently push air into the vial to equalize the pressure so that the solution can be withdrawn easily. Step 11. Keeping the needle inside the vial, gently turn the vial upside down. Step 12. Gently pull back the tip of the needle to the same level as the rubber stopper. Step 13. Withdraw the correct dosage by pulling back the plunger or allow the fluid to enter the syringe automatically. Repeat steps 5 to 13 if required. Step 14. Once you have reached the prescribed vial dosage with the needle in the vial, held upside down, tap the syringe to remove air bubbles if any. Depress the plunger to expel air into the vial. Step 15. Now turn the vial upright and remove the needle. Step 16. Change the needle 27 gauge thickness and half inch length and the injection is now ready to be injected. It is recommended to follow your physician's advice regarding the administration of the injection either subcutaneously or intramuscularly. Tips for less painful injection. Massage the injection site to calm the area of injection. Time is the key. Injecting the drug slowly and continuously helps to reduce pain. Try to relax before the injection. Procedure for Intramuscular Injection First, choose your injection site. The thigh is best suited for self-administration of an intramuscular injection. The injection should go in the outer side of the mid-thigh. Ensure that your hands are washed thoroughly before the procedure. Clean the injection site with the alcohol swab. Take the prepared needle and the injection. Hold the needle like a dart and insert it swiftly into the thigh muscle at a 90 degree angle. Now push the plunger slowly to inject the medication into the muscle. Once the medication is pushed, withdraw the needle quickly at the same angle and discard it safely. Do not put the cap back on the needle. With a gauze swab, apply light pressure on the injection site for around 20 to 30 seconds. 
you may also massage the area to help absorption of the medication into the muscle. Note that it is normal to see slight bleeding. Use a bandage if necessary. Procedure for subcutaneous injection. Choose the injection site 2 inches from the navel. Ensure that your hands are thoroughly washed before the procedure. Clean the injection site with the alcohol swab. Take the prepared needle and injection. Gently pinch the skin at your chosen injection site using the thumb and index finger of the hand that is not holding the needle. Pinch up the skin. Quickly insert the needle all the way into the pinched area of the skin. If 2 inches of the skin is grasped, the needle should be inserted at a 90 degree angle. If only 1 inch of the skin is grasped, the needle should be inserted at a 45 degree angle. With the needle inserted, release the skin and inject the medication by slowly pushing down the plunger for about 20 seconds. Remove the needle at the same angle that it was inserted and discard it safely. With a gauze swab, apply light pressure on the injection site for around 20 to 30 seconds. Dispose the needles safely to avoid accidents.